Want higher FPS in Counter-Strike 2 without risky tweaks? Watch carefully, I'll show you how to boost it safely and make your game buttery smooth. Frustrated with lag and high pain? Gear Up Booster can fix it instantly. Check the download link in the description and get smooth lag-free gameplay in seconds. Step 1. Disable full screen optimizations for CS2 if Counter-Strike 2 feels laggy or stutters. Disable full screen optimizations for a quick fix. Open Steam, right click CS2, go to Manage, gives Browse Local Files, then Open Game gives Bin gives Win 64. And find CS2.exe, right click, choose Properties. And under Compatibility Check, disable full screen optimizations and hit Apply. Also enable High DP I override set to application. Back in Steam, add Full screen under Launch Options. Finally, launch CS2. Set display mode to full screen and use CL underscore shows one to compare before and after. You'll notice smoother FPS and less stutter instantly. Step two, view advanced system settings to access advanced system settings in Windows. Start by clicking the start menu and typing view advanced system settings, then click the top result. This will open the system properties window directly to the advanced tab here under the Performance section, click the Settings button to open the Performance Options menu. In this window, you can choose how Windows handles visual effects. You'll see options like Adjust for Best Appearance, which enables all visual effects for a polished look, and Adjust for Best Performance, which disables them to maximize speed. You can also select Custom to manually toggle individual. Effects such as window animations, shadows, or smooth fonts. For example, turning off the option Animate Windows when minimizing and maximizing will instantly remove the animation effect. Making windows snap open or closed without delay, this can improve system responsiveness, especially on older hardware. Once you've made your choices, click Apply, then OK to confirm the changes. Step 3. How to use NVIDIA Profile Inspector for CS2 to optimize Counter-Strike 2. You can download this tool quickly from the website link provided in the description and start optimizing your PC right away, CS2, using NVIDIA Profile Inspector. Start by running the tool as an administrator to ensure it has full access to modify driver level settings. This utility provides far more detailed control than the standard NVIDIA control panel. Once open, Click the drop-down menu in the top left and search for the Counter-Strike 2 profile. If it's not available, you can manually create a profile by adding the path to cs2.exe. After selecting or creating the profile, begin adjusting the key settings. Set frame rate limiter mode to off or off v3 if available to avoid unnecessary. Frame caps, switch low latency mode to ultra to reduce input lag. Change power management mode to prefer maximum performance so your GPU runs at full clock speeds. And turn threaded optimization to on for better multi-core CPU handling. If your monitor supports it, enable DSYNC for both full screen and windowed modes to reduce screen tearing and stutter. Once all changes are made, click the apply changes button, check mark icon at the top right to save them. These adjustments are especially useful for competitive play as they help achieve more consistent frame rates, smoother input response, and fewer micro stutters. It's recommended to keep NVIDIA Profile Inspector installed as settings may reset after a GPU driver. Update requiring reapplication. Step 4. How to use Intelligent Standby List Cleaner. You can download this tool quickly from the website link provided in the description and start optimizing your PC right away to use Intelligent Standby List Cleaner, ISLC, effectively. Start by running it as an administrator to allow proper memory management. Once open, you'll see your system's total RAM, free memory, and the size of the standby list which can cause stuttering if it grows too large. To automate cleaning, check the options to start ISLC minimized and auto start monitoring. Set the free memory trigger to around 1024 megabytes and the standby list size to a similar value. Enable custom timer resolution at 0.50 milliseconds to reduce latency. 
then click start. ISLC will now run in the background. Clearing memory when needed and helping maintain smoother performance during gaming. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping and smoother gameplay in any game. The tool is called Gear Up Booster, and you can download it directly from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC and launch the app. Once it opens, log in with your Google or Facebook account to access all features. On the Home tab, Gear Up automatically detects the games installed on your PC. If you want, you can also explore thousands of other games for optimization in the Games tab. To start boosting, go back to the Home tab and select the game you want, for example, Fortnite. Just hit the Boost button and the tool will instantly begin optimizing your connection. Gear Up will automatically locate the best server for you, but you can also choose a region manually. Always pick the server closest to your location for the lowest ping. In my case, the Middle East server gives the best results. After selecting your region, head to the end tab where you'll see all available servers. You can either choose the nearest one or let gear up. Automatically select the most stable option. I recommend using automatic mode for consistent performance. Finally, close the settings and launch your game directly through Gear Up Booster. That's it. This tool helps you get a more stable connection, lower ping, and even better FPS. Making your gameplay smoother and more enjoyable whether you're playing Fortnite or any other supported game. Step 5. How to use Run with Affinity tool to optimize Counter-Strike 2 CS2. You can download this tool quickly from the website link provided in the description and start optimizing your PC right away. Using Run with Affinity, start by launching the application and opening the main interface. First, click the dot 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 button next to select program, then navigate to your CS2 installation folder, usually located at Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Counter-Strike, Global Offensive, Game, Bin, Win64, and select CS2.exe. Once selected, go to the Select Affinity section. Here, you'll choose which CPU cores CS2 should use. For example, entering the value 63 enables cores CPU 0 to CPU 5 which can help reduce stutters by keeping the game on high performance cores, especially on multi-core or hybrid CPUs. You can also adjust how the game launches by setting the run option to normal, minimized, or maximized. When you're ready, either click Run Program to launch CS2 immediately with these affinity settings, or click Create Shortcut to save this setup to your desktop for quick access in the future. After applying affinity, CS2 should run with more consistent CPU usage and smoother frame pacing. Especially helpful if your system experiences background load or uneven core distribution. During gameplay, step six, how to use part control tool for CS2 to optimize Counter-Strike 2. You can download this tool quickly from the website link provided in the description and start optimizing your PC right away, CS2. Using part control, start by launching the application. In the top drop-down menu, select Bitsum Highest Performance and click Make Active to apply it as your current power plan. This plan is designed to maximize CPU performance during gaming. Next, disable all CPU core parking and frequency scaling settings under Parking AC, Parking DC, Frec Scaling AC, and Frec Scaling DC. Select Disabled and make sure the sliders are set to 100%. This ensures that all CPU cores stay active and that your processor maintains its maximum clock speed at all times, preventing stuttering and lag caused by dynamic scaling. Click Apply to save the changes. Additionally, make sure Bitsum Dynamic Boost is enabled to automatically maintain high performance during commanding tasks like gaming. You can also check the box to show notifications when power plans change. Once applied, you should notice all cores running consistently at full speed, which can help reduce input delay and improve frame time stability in CS2. This simple configuration ensures your CPU won't throttle down during gameplay, leading to smoother and more responsive performance overall. And that's it. Your CS2 should now be running smoother and faster. 
If you saw a difference, drop a like and share it with your squad. More quick FPS hacks coming, stay tuned.